science teachers of Reddit, how do you respond to students who deny accepted science? 1. I teach an intro astronomy course at my university and I'm pretty sure there's at least one denier every year. I don't bother arguing, and that's all they're interested in. Arguing. They don't actually want to learn. If they want to put down the wrong answer on their test, I'll just mark them incorrect and move on. If they continue to answer incorrectly, they'll fail the course. It's their money, and they're free to spend it on a course they'll purposely fail if that's what they really want to do. 2. Biology teacher. Here. Get one or two students a year that have a problem with talking about evolution. One student even went as far as to recite Genesis while I was giving my lecture. The way I approach it is to tell them flat out. We are going to focus on what is accepted in the scientific community as our best explanation to how organisms change over time. We will only discuss the facts that support that explanation. This is preceded by a unit about what science is and isn't. Put a lot of emphasis on the fact that there are some questions that science cannot answer because they are outside of the scope of scientific inquiry. Is there a God? And, is there an afterlife? Are two examples. 3. I teach at a Catholic high school in the Deep South. I teach evolution in 1 a.m. thorough. Sometimes I have students come to me because they do not believe in evolution and they are, concerned. Very gently assure them that they are free to believe whatever they believe. I expect them to be able to explain what the consensus of scientists is and how science explains evolution. I take their personal beliefs out of the equation, entirely. 4. I'm not a teacher, but I know someone who failed multiple assignments in biology because she didn't believe in evolution. 5. Not science related, but one had a kid in my history class argue with the professor that slavery wasn't a factor in the Civil War. Not that it was one of many factors, didn't try to downplay it, he just said it had nothing to do with slavery and was all about the different cultures. When presented with the secession documents from several states claiming slavery as their main reason for seceding, he just said, well of course they'd come up with a document like that after the fact, the winners always rewrite history.